Good morning, folks. I uh, think you just watched a little bit of video about me moving the uh, chicken coop and the fence and all that. I don't know how much of that there is because I haven't watched that yet. And I kept having battery problems because uh, I had a non-Canon battery in my Canon camera. And that battery's just a problem. It was supposed to have been fully charged, but obviously it was not. Um... I went ahead and moved it. I kept trying to wait to move the chicken coop till it wasn't just squishy, nasty, wet ground, uh, a little bit of dry. And I finally gave up because where the chicken coop was, looks like that. I mean, it's starting to look like a pigsty. There ain't no grass left. It's all big mud hole. Uh, so today, they're over here. They're quite happy. Um, but breakfast this morning for the chickens. Here, watch this. quite the smorgasbord. It's also the reason why there wasn't a video yesterday. After I fed the chickens yesterday, I went in the house uh, to get something out of the freezer to lay out for supper. Uh, I was gonna make some chicken noodle soup uh, today, uh, try to finish it up today. And uh, when we was moving stuff out of the garage, apparently somebody bumped the plug. It was not all the way out of the wall, but it was loose. Freezer had been off for about three days. Everything in there was thawed. So the chickens had a marvelous, marvelous breakfast this morning. There's, they still have meat. They still got chicken, not chicken noodle soup. They've got uh, vegetable soup and sweet corn and everything else in their pans. Uh, they had uh, all the leftovers because I made a big pot of chicken noodle soup. Um, eight leg quarters. Uh, that's a lot of chicken noodle soup. Um, but I made that yesterday. I've got stuff I'm going to have cooked today or tomorrow, or maybe Missy will. Uh, chicken parts. <sighs> I hate throwing away food. Throwing away, but at least we've been trying to clean. I mean, this is a bright point. We've been trying, because we're trying to move. Uh, I mean, we're planning to move sometime in the near future. If we got any place to move to, hopefully not to a hotel. That would suck. Uh... But at least we've been trying to clean out the freezer and get rid of stuff so we don't have a big bunch of stuff. So, that's a happy thought. Um, today, uh, I'm going to do what I planned to do yesterday and today. And that is, I'm going to start throwing rocks in this hole where this pond was and try to get some dirt on top of it. Try to make it look like it ought to. Uh, but that's my big plan for today. Right now, I didn't do anything to it yesterday. After I discovered that freezer... I spent the whole day cooking, cleaning, mopping. Ah, mess. Absolute mess. Anyway, today I'm going to try and deal with that mess. Oh, yuck. I don't want to deal with that mess, but it must be done. Try and fill that hole in before it rains tonight and fills it with water. Uh, everybody say hi to Mr. Gray. I don't know what he's looking at, but he's got it under control. Good morning, Mr. Gray. I know. Uh, in the meantime, time to get busy. Whether I like it or not, I don't want to deal with this hole. Must be done. And it's a bombing. I think it's 34 degrees. It's supposed to get 40 today, but I, I don't think it's going to make it. Not unless this gray dismal runs off and we get a sunbeam somewhere. Anyway, let's get to work. Get started at legacybox.com slash rush and you will get 40% off. That's 40% off, folks, at legacybox.com slash rush. Legacybox.com.
I'm out here working, hot chocolate shows up. Sometimes Missy knows just what to do to make me happy. Oh, good stuff. It's the hot chocolate you buy in the Mexican section of the store. Uh, it's got cinnamon, extra stuff in there. I don't know what all's in it. It's really good stuff, though. <laughs> Makes me happy. Stand here and drink this for a minute and then go back to work. Okay, well, I just wanted to get a quick pick here. Uh, just to show what it looks like now that all of the uh, block is out. Um, and that's what I mean, everything's out. I still got dirt to put back, I got to rebuild the wall, I still got a lot of work to do, but everything's out of that hole. And I'll be honest and say, I had no idea there was that much block in that hole. Okay, I'm just doing this because Missy's been after me to get rid of this little mound of dirt out here. Uh, you can see how big it is, that's a normal rake. <clears throat> that's how big that little mound of dirt was. It was maybe uh, eight, ten inches tall. And that's all it was, a little mound of dirt. That's where my father had put a flagpole at one point. Obviously when he made that mound of dirt, he used a rock or two. Because <laughs> all of that came out of about eight inches of dirt. The answer is no, I'm not done, but uh, I got it to where I can put dirt in there and uh, start trying to make it look a little bit better tomorrow. Um, if I can get go get the dirt between raindrops. That's where I'm calling it a day. It's almost five o'clock, temperature's starting to drop. I think the sun went down. It's kind of hard to tell with this clouds. Uh, not too bad. Not too bad, got quite a bit of work done today. That's a lot of block lifting. That's hard work. So I feel good about what I got done today. Um, tomorrow, I'm gonna go buy dirt and hopefully get some hay bales and stuff. Uh, we'll talk about that with the chicken coop. I gotta get some stuff in there. Um, it's not too cold right now. Actually right now, it's probably 40, 42 degrees. Feels pretty good out here to me. Uh, but at some point in time next week, it's supposed to be nine degrees. And with that uh, portable chicken coop and all the wire underneath and airflow and all that, I, I got to get some straw or something in there. Uh, get something in there for them chickens to have a little barrier between them and the fresh air. Uh, but that's it for today. Uh, remember, my name's Mark. Just some old Kentucky homesteader. Uh, you know the deal. If you like it, uh, subscribe, like the bell all that kind of stuff and in the meantime you have a very blessed day <laughs>